The Significance of the Dead Sea Scrolls. In 1947, these Bedouin shepherds discovered the scrolls. And this is eventually what they found in the, I think there were 11 caves uh, complete. 40,000 inscribed fragments, 500 complete books were reconstructed from those caves. Every single Old Testament book was discovered except for Esther. And these biblical scrolls, biblical manuscripts, had been protected there for almost 2,000 years. And when they started to look at them, this is one of the most important things. Now, they found many other things with them. For example, they found the Manual of Discipline, which outlined how the community treated each other and what they did, all the laws and disciplines. Then they found the Thanksgiving Psalms. And then the Habakkuk Commentary. These were the commentaries of the Old Testament. Then they found portions of what's called the Genesis Apocryphon. Then there was another, just it was a very small portion of a scroll called the War Scroll. But the most significant was this. The first Isaiah scroll in excellent condition after 2,000 years, and the second Isaiah scroll, which wasn't in near the same condition. And then they found just a few fragments of what's referred to as the pierced Messiah fragment. It's not talking about Jesus directly here, but it was about they believed that there would rise a Messiah whose body would be pierced. Over 15,000 fragments in just cave number four from over 580 different ancient manuscripts. What a discovery. Now, many of these are encased within the shrine of the book in Jerusalem. But what was the significance of the Isaiah scroll? You will be amazed at what it proved. 